On the 26th of November, we visited the Tate Modern Gallery to see the Conflict, Time and Photography exhibition. During our visit, we were given a private tour from the curator and director of the Tate Modern. They took us round and explained some of their favourite pieces to us, as well as explaining the significance. It's also about the fact that conflicts don't end when we think they end. They, they have a long-lasting effect, both on landscapes and on people. I left this series by Harry Schunk and Janos Kender. It was made in Berlin about five or six years later. Here we see the wall completely dividing the city, cutting through um, roads, through buildings. We see um, individuals trying to kind of deal with this massive construction. So you get a sense of the, the, the long-term after effects of the Second World War, but also the beginning of the Cold War. So these two different forms of conflict overlapping one another. What do you think about the exhibition? Um, I really enjoyed the exhibition, particularly the way the rooms like chron chronologically follow and the whole exhibition tells a story. Mm -hmm. And I like the way there's been like mergers of newcoming artists and classic artists as well. And I like the way they've incorporated like photography in a different way, so all the framework is presented differently, it's very abstract. They um, experiment with sizing and um, layouts, which is really interesting. The Conflict Time and Photography Exhibition will be open till the 15th of March 2015. It's definitely worth your time, make sure you don't miss it. <laughs>